A lot of things to worry about during Cybersecurity Month. For me, it is identity theft, that's happened to me twice, and credit rating, managing my own credit rating. Well, years ago, someone simply diverted the mail, got a new driver's license with his picture and my name, and bought a brand new car with a car loan. I've never bought a brand new car, I've never had a car loan. No one noticed that this kind of purchase was way outside my normal purchasing profiles. Well, I called TransUnion and Equifax, the credit rating agencies, and said, I do not need credit. I will not need credit in the future. Please do not give any credit to this person with my name. Done. Now, some years after that, people walked into the bank, deposited some money into my account, then withdrew a larger amount to make the transactions look legitimate, and then wire transferred many, many hundreds of thousands of dollars to we don't know where. Well, I called up TransUnion and Equifax and I said, um, how's my you know, ban on credit? Oh no, you have good credit, sir. I said, but I had it removed some years ago. Yes, but that only lasts a few years and we give it back to you without even my knowledge. We citizens and residents must be able to turn off TransUnion and Equifax if we wish and then turn it back on if we wish for free. Many people later in life have either paid off their mortgages or they rent, they do not need a car loan, they do not need credit. Leave us alone, credit rating agencies, in my view.